Welcome to another episode of Muskrat Creek, where all the animals talk about Jesus Christ and the Bible. We couldn't have picked a better day to sit out in the sun and chew up all the furniture out of our muskrat den. Yeah, cousin, we got it made. So while I'm on the subject, how about confessing our sin unto God? And asking Jesus Christ to wash it away in the blood of Jesus he shed on the cross? Now my question is, so how does you know you done something wrong? How do you know you got sin? Well, you know, God gave Moses, the Jewish prophet, the laws of God. You know, sort of a, a list of things of what not to do. God's law is in the Bible, called the book of Leviticus. And the Ten Commandments is also part of God's law. Yeah, I got the list of the Ten Commandments. Let me dig them out of here and I'll read them to you. Yeah, I got them stuck down in here somewhere. Just a second. There we go. Exodus 20, 2 through 17. Thou shalt have no other gods before me. Thou shalt not make an idol nor bow down to it, nor worship it. Thou shalt not take the Lord your God's name in vain. Don't misuse the name of God. And remember to keep the Sabbath day holy. Honor your father and your mother. Thou shalt not kill. Thou shalt do no mighty. Thou shalt not commit adultery. Men don't cheat on their wives. Thou shalt not steal. Thou shalt not lie. Do not bear false witness against your neighbor. And remember, if you're not an eyewitness, you're a false witness. Thou shalt not covet. Don't be envious of your neighbor's house, their cars, their goods. And don't covet your neighbor's wife. You go to the Bible to find out the right way to live. What's right and what's in wrong. You use it as a guide for your life. In 1 John 2, 3 and 4. And hereby we do know that we know him if we keep his commandments. 1 John 2, 2. If we sin... We have an advocate with the Father, which is Jesus Christ. You pray to the Father in Jesus' name. Ask him to wash away all your sin with the blood of Jesus Christ he shed on the cross. So how you know you have sin? It's if you've broken one of the commandments God gave. And if you do slip up in sin, you repent and turn from your evil ways. Yeah, I'm glad God provided a way for us to repent through His Son, Jesus Christ, and His death on the cross. This has been another episode of Muskrat Creek, where all the animals are talking about Jesus Christ and the Bible. Look for more cartoons, claymation, and puppet videos by Carrie Guerin Scoggins at Carrie Guerin Scoggins Christian Claymation Puppet Cartoons Blogspot.com.